What's up, you guys? Welcome back to another Roblox video. Today, we're going to be playing Escape the Evil Barbershop, Obby. A perfect day to get that fresh new haircut. That would be if only the barbershop was normal. Well, I do really need a haircut. My hair is getting kind of long, but uh, not if the barber's going to be evil. Escape the barbershop. Here we go. We're going in. We're going to get a fresh cut, G. Ah, oh, what a beautiful day to get a new haircut. Well, I hope this doesn't turn out to be one of those escape obbies. I think it's going to be. Did I just get slapped? What the heck? Click or tap to break the rope. Okay. <laughs> Did I just get tied up? Hey, man, I just came here for a haircut. The second I walk in the door, you tie me up with rope. Are you the barber? Um, oh, you kind of look like a barber. All right, I guess I'll just sit down and uh, get my hair cut. Wait, you're not the barber? Oh, well, where is he? Hello? Did I just teleport? What is this? Oh, it's a... <laughs> I didn't even know what I was looking at. What did I just do? I just pushed a cabinet? Okay, oh, and we gotta go up in the vent. I was thinking we would have to go in that door, but it's locked. <laughs> Guys, I'm not paying attention, am I? <laughs> it's hard with no dialogue sometimes. Okay, that door looks like it's locked. All right, we can't go through there. What are those? Those like giant shampoo bottles or something? I can't even tell what that is. I have no idea. Whoa, what did you do? He just blew a giant bubble. <laughs> He's flying. <laughs> what? So we just gotta, oh, we gotta jump into the shampoo bubble. How cool, dude. And we can fly over to the next platform. Let's go. All right. Cool, dude. Uh-oh, we got toxic hairspray. What happens if, I was gonna say, what would happen if we stepped into it? We get oof. Just like that. So my guess is that it's not actually hairspray. It kind of, whoa, it kind of looks like fire. It's kind of like a flamethrower. We got purple, red, and green. Don't get, don't get hit, man. You just walked right into it. I'm going to wait up for them because I have no idea what this is supposed to be. I don't know if I can step on that. I'm going to make them do it first. Come on, bro. You can do it. Don't step into it. Just take your time, all right? Slow and steady wins the barber, the, the barber shop. Okay, you know what? We're just going to go ahead. I'm sure he'll catch up. Guys, can you step on this for me? Thank you. I was a little scared. But now we have scissors. Scissors racing out of the walls. I want to see somebody get chopped up with the scissors. Come on, somebody get their head sliced off. At least get, like, your wig cut off a little bit. I mean, this is a barber shop after all. Okay, fine, I'll do it. I'll do it. <laughs> I'm telling you, I just need a haircut. That's all I'm really trying to do over here. What is this? Just a red thing? Just some random red thing that... <laughs> that <laughs> made my body explode. I don't even know what that's supposed to be. This obby is so confusing. What is this? It's an arrow. Oh, and it's pointing up. Oh, we gotta grab it. We gotta grab the thing. And then that drops down the ladder. So you gotta pull in the rope to make the ladder to the attic fall down. How cool. All right, let's keep moving, guys. So we're in the attic. I don't know what that is. Is that rumbling supposed to be us? Yeah, it was us running across the boards. Doggy, let me see your avatar real quick, dude. What is that? He's got an orangutan on his shirt. That orangutan looks like he needs a haircut. Very cool. <laughs> Wait, what is that? What is that? What the heck is that? Hello? Is that a robot? Oh, it's a person. Bro, what are you doing? You're hiding from the barber? Wait, the barber's in here? I don't, <gasps> he is in here and he just locked the door. Hello, are you here to cut my hair? Hey, you shouldn't be in here. Oh, he's nice. Um, okay, bro. And then he turns evil. What, oh, he's right there. <laughs> oh my gosh. I wanna see his jump scare. Why were you so nice to me and all of a sudden you have this disgusting looking creepy smile. Jump scare. Police sirens? Is that, is that supposed to be like siren cops jump scare? That's what it, that's what it sounded like. Wait, where? 
Did I make it? Oh, this is the room that we were in before. You guys, the entire place has no power. Because the evil barber is going to try to get us again. I can't jump on that. I don't even know what I can step on and what I can't. I'm just going to keep jumping over everything. You're not going to get me. I don't. I want to know like what he said right before he turned evil and all the lights turned off. Because he was like super friendly. And then he was super evil. Okay. Uh, what is that? Those are like shavers. Like the old school razors. Ooh. Those are probably sharper than actual knives. Don't get sliced. Someone's getting sliced in this. Guaranteed. Let's see who's gonna get hit by the- By the knives! By the razors! It was almost me. Oh wait, this one's not even moving. Alright, good job guys. Nobody got sliced unless this guy does. Come on dude, you can make it! Knives! Um... Hello? Is this a mannequin? What is this? <laughs> That's so creepy. <laughs> the creepy mannequins. Maybe they have presents for us. Nope, that doesn't open. They don't have anything for us. What the heck? Locked. Um. Hello? That was one of the mannequins. What did he do? Did he knock us out? And then he like put us in this... Bro, this is like a... This is like a crazy person room. It's like a padded room for the crazy people. Do they want us to click this? Click. Oh, it gave us a hammer. Whoa. Okay, we got to hit this three times. One, two, three. Bust that wall down. And we have a weapon to arm ourselves in case that smelly little barber comes back. What is this? I thought we were at a barber shop. We're in a dungeon with... Like crazy swinging axes. Go! Nobody gets sliced by the axes, please. I need all my friends to make it out alive. We still need to have a little word with our barber. We're gonna have like a boss battle with him, I bet. What do we have to do now? Locked. All the doors are locked. Lasers. Whoa, what is this stuff? Do we have to smash? Oh, cool. I collected something. Is it a badge? Oh, nice, we got a badge. Okay, I think we got a secret badge. Click. Okay, we turned that. Oh, he changed his hair color. Cool. And then he turned into a woman. Oh, we have to match it with this, I think. Okay, so we have one, two. So we have a woman, and then another woman with a different hairstyle. Click it again. I think, wait, unless this is it? I am so confused. Oh wait, pink. Pink is the boy with the the hair. Okay, so this one might be correct. Oh, and this one's correct because I don't have to click it anymore. Guys, I just realized the lasers turned off. I have no idea what we just did. That was super confusing, but... Oh wait, the blue one's over there. You just gotta match the colors up. He did not match the colors up. He got zapped by the laser. Let's just uh, continue on. What is this? We got like sewage water down here and pipes that are shooting out slime water or something. Whoa. And I lost my hammer. Just great. What if that barber comes back? Then what? Then we're all in trouble. Hopefully there are some more weapons for us. Uh oh, what is this? It's like a mannequin head. <laughs> These mannequins are creepy. This one's not as scary because that has a face. So what do we have to do? Just not get zapped? Whoa. Okay. <laughs> that was pretty simple, but it, I think that's really cool. That was just really easy, though. You can't stump me on these obbies, okay? I'm an obby pro, especially when it comes to getting my hair cut. That didn't really make any sense. Getting my hair cut has nothing to do with me being an obby pro. But we are at a barbershop obby. So we just got spit out of a pipe. And now we jump on this thing. And then this. Okay, so it's like little platforms that I, I clearly am not skilled enough to get across. After explaining how much of an obby pro I was. Put me back in the pipe, dude. What stage are we on? 15? We got five more stages to go, I think. Okay, here we go. Don't fall. Don't fall. That's all you gotta do. Simple as that. Just don't fall. 
Uh-oh, look out, dude! <laughs> Sorry. I kind of collapse. <laughs> I kind of collapse that for you. I think you're supposed to go one at a time. Yeah, definitely is a one at a time type of thing. Oh, great. Wait, you're not supposed to jump in there? Oh, you are. You have to oof yourself onto the checkpoint? Really? <laughs> you got to jump through the acid to get to the other side. That looks like a lever that we might have to pull down. Oh, wait. He's pulling that one down. Yeah, you guys go do it. I'm being lazy right now. I think I have to do it. It's probably a one-person thing. It's probably not going to work unless we do it. There we go. Okay, now I think we have to turn on the other light. So let's go over to the other side. These are some very weird contraptions going on here at the barber shop. We're like underground, which is usually the case in these type of hobbies. First, we were in a dungeon, and then this like science lab thing. It's kind of like a science bunker. I think the mannequin put us down here like when he knocked us out, but still no barber. Okay, so we climbed like out of this sewer vent. And now what? Maybe like a speed run? Uh-oh. Bro, this man is on a golf cart and he's got a bazooka in his hand. Are you kidding me? Where did you get that? <laughs> I just wanted a haircut. <laughs> and you're out here riding a golf cart with a bazooka? <laughs> what the heck? Oh, he's chasing us. What happens if we get ran over? He literally blows our head off with a bazooka. This is the most random... Abby ever why why is he in a golf cart? How is he gonna get across this? Oh my gosh, he can actually drive across all of those holes. What the heck, dude? He's just running through everything right now. Is he trying to shoot us or are there random bombs blowing up? I just broke my legs. I broke my legs on the car and then I ran over the cones. Try me again, dude. See what happens. I put on brand new Nikes. You ain't catching me. Don't hit the cars this time. I don't want to break my ankles. Oh, what is that? Oh, he's putting down like landmines too. That's what those are. I was looking at him the whole time. That's probably how I crashed into the car. See you later, Smelly. Peace out. Oh, this isn't the end. That's the end over there, but of course, there's like just this random swinging axe thing. Yes, let's get back in the bubble. I want to go in the bubble. Come on. I think I have to wait my turn. Yep. Who's going to step on it next? Yes, it's my... Wait, what? Wait, where's this guy going? Yes, it's my turn. <laughs> the bubble is so cool. That took very long to get to the other side, but... Let's go ahead and grab this key up here. That's what it looks like we got to do. The golden key to the lock of the winner's gate. Let's go. Put me in. I need the badge. That's what I'm talking about, dude. What is this? A potion. Should I drink it? Sure, why not? What's the worst that could happen? Um. Oh, it's a speedy potion. <laughs> wow, I'm going extremely fast. Whoa. They also make you jump really big. And then I died. Well, you guys, I didn't even get a haircut. I think I'm just going to have to look for a different barber next time. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed Escape the Creepy Barbershop Obby. If you guys want to see more, smack the like button. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in the next one. Peace.